It's the 4th of July, so let's celebrate with a beautiful red, white, and blue manicure. I'm using Morgan Taylor nail polish shades. The blue is called Baby It's Bold Outside. Let's get started. The white, some girls prefer pearls. And the red, put on your dancing shoes. I applied two coats of the blue, two coats of the red, and three thin coats of the pearly white. The red shade has a semi-matte finish, and you can still kind of see my nail line, and the blue has a glossy finish. I want to do a stars and stripes design, so I'm going to use my H. La Cocedora stamping plates. This one is called Back to Basics, and it has a lot of beautiful designs. They're simple, and this is like a basic plate that you definitely want to have in your collection. I also want to use this one which is called Life is a Party 2 and it has a bunch of celebration images so I thought I could use the stars in this section. These are acrylic stamping plates and they're available at the H. La Cocedora website. I'll have a link in the description box below and you can use my discount code JENNY10 to save 10% off your order at hlacocedora.com. I'm loving the simplicity of the design just as is, but I wanted to stamp something on the white nail. It seems a little bit too plain. So I want to use this stamping plate. This one is called Life is a Party and it has some cute fireworks here. So I was thinking maybe I could add a couple of those, uh, maybe this one, but it might be too much. So let's start with these little ones. Even though this one isn't a stamping polish, I want to try to use it and see if it'll show over this white polish. That looks pretty good. That's cute. I really like it. I'm loving how the design turned out. Now I just have to apply a top coat and I think I'm going to go with a matte top coat. I'm going to use this one from Adored Colors. It's called Matte World. When the matte top coat dries, the manicure is complete and I love the way it turned out. It's a simple but beautiful design for the 4th of July. As you can see, when I first applied the matte top coat on the red and white nail, it turned it a little bit pink. So I went ahead and stamped the white one more time over it and the lines didn't come out perfect, but that's okay. I really like it in the end. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Thanks so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye!